precision, Dulux precision. Now it's 24 hours since this door was painted. You've seen me sand it, an 80 grit sandpaper, so it should be good. So 24 hours, this is after 12 hours, 24 hours, look at that. Fail, 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 fail. 24 hours, no good at all. Oil based undercoat, only way to go. Get some paper. Make sure your light switch isn't turned on. Just jam that up there like that. So when I'm sanding these walls in the repaint, um, sometimes I use different sandpaper. Now this one here is a 180. I don't know if you can see that. It's a no-fill 180 sandpaper. Now that one there is good for new homes. It's good for undercoats. It's good for um, very fine stuff just getting cobwebs off. This is what we use on um, repaints. So this is an 80 grit, the other one is a 180 grit. I have one set up on here and then I have another one set up here for smoother stuff. So um, that's an 80 grit or 180 grit. Now this is only two little rooms in this house so we've got a few left. Got another main bedroom plus all the kitchen, laundry, everything like that. Um, we've already used half a drum of paint. Spraying everything, we're going to use a lot more paint. One of the downsides of spraying everything. So here we have, we have a hardwood front door. And um, this is a pretty typical. Um, they've put a, a coat of uh, clear gloss uh, lacquer over it, probably 10 or 20 years ago. Now if we try to paint that with any paint, it's likely to scratch off, it's not going to work properly. So what we've got to do, we've got to give it a good scratch down. And then we can put the precision on it. We've got to leave that overnight and then we can paint it tomorrow. Or we can give it a bit of a scratch down, basically just a very light scratch down. Um, with the, the pole sander and that. And then we can put a coat of oil based undercoat, quick dry oil based undercoat. Uh, or we could, and we could paint it today. So you be the um, decision maker on this one. Now, I don't have to paint this door today. And to be honest with you, do I really trust a precision? Probably not. Um, do I trust the oil-based undercoat? Absolutely, with my life. On a tree. I'm just sitting here. I got time. From up here, the world seems small. We can sit to I've decided to go the precision maximum strength of his primer so on that door. Only because really I've already got a wet roller out. And I can just dip that in, roll that, and I'll put a little brush out. In the great outdoor forever free. Step back to see the truth.